here we have a pre-calculus problem. Okay, let's go over the question. If log 2 equals to 0 0.3010 and log 3 equals to 0 0.4771, then the value of log 24 is. So we have uh, values of two logarithms, log 2 and log 3, and we have to evaluate the uh, value of log 24. Okay, so log 24. Okay, so what I need to do is I have to resolve this 24 into the prime factors 2 and 3. Because I have uh, values for log 2 and log 3. I have the prime numbers 2 and 3 over here. So I have to resolve this 24 into the prime factors 2 and 3. So for that, I am writing 24 as 8 times 3. Okay, so here the two values are in multiplication. I mean, in the argument of this logarithm, two values are in multiplication. So whenever two values are uh, multiplied in the argument of logarithm, we can use a product rule of logarithm. So that is, uh, we have to take logarithm for each of these two values and I have to add them. So then I'll be getting log 8 positive log 3. Okay, so already we have prime number 3 over here, but I have to write this 8 uh, in terms of uh, prime number 2. So already we know that 8 uh, equals to uh, 2 to the third power. So we can write, instead of 8, we can write 2 to the third power positive log 3. Okay, here uh, the argument is exponential. Whenever the argument is exponential, the exponent we have over here can be moved in front of the logarithm and it has to be multiplied by the logarithm. So it's a power rule of logarithm. So in the next step, log 3 times log 2 positive log 3. Okay, now uh, we got uh, the given logarithm in terms of log 2 and 3. So that I will be able to plug in the value 0 0.3010 for log 2 and 0 0.4771 for log 3. Okay, let's plug in 0 0.3010 for log 2. Then I'll be getting 3 times uh, 0 0.3010 positive. For log 3, we have 0 0.4771. Okay, so when I multiply this 0 0.3010, I'll be getting 0 0.9030 positive, uh, 0 0.4771. When I add them, I'll be getting 1.3801. So the evaluation of log 24 is 1.3801. So the correct answer choice for this question is option C.